Young girls reaching puberty, in some cases as young as age seven. Well, there may be many possible causes, but now researchers believe they know why. The Night Team's David Douglas is here with an explanation, David. Simply put, Eric and Sarah, it's calories. Research being done on the UW-Madison campus found that concerns over early puberty in girls leading to cancers and disease could be traced back to eating habits. This research done in primates it gives us a first glimpse at how we might ultimately reverse this troubling trend. These monkeys might not know it, but researchers believe rhesus macaques may actually hold the secret to early puberty in girls. The animals that did eat more um, had a dramatically advanced age of puberty onset. As preteens, a group of monkeys started on a diet with 30% more sugar and fat than their peers. They were getting bigger though. They weren't necessarily getting much fatter than other monkeys. Just six months after beginning the regimen, the female macaques menstruated for the first time. Something Joe Kirian explains did not happen in the control group for another 12 to 18 months. It certainly gives us good evidence to suggest that they, that diet is in fact responsible for advancing puberty onset. The findings were published Tuesday in the journal Endocrinology. Lead researcher A. Tarasawa worries earlier puberties could stunt brain development, particularly in areas that define our judgment. That part of the brain is much later, much even in a human 21 to 25 years old to complete. Ongoing research could help doctors reset the developmental clock so it ticks at the right pace. We should have a certain developmental stage. We should have a proper process of puberty. Male monkeys were not part of the study as it's simply harder to tell when they reach maturity. But Kirian cautions parents from using the findings as part of any attempt to accelerate nature. Certainly it's not, it's not in the best interest to try and advance maturation. We do believe that what we are finding in these animals is very translatable to humans. And he tells us where we've been so concerned about obesity as it relates to calorie intake for so long, it might not be the only problem. But again, the study animals didn't get fat because they were eating in the right period where their body was using up the energy in other ways. Well, pretty interesting stuff. Uh, what's the big takeaway from all this, David? Well, I think one of the things that Tarasawa told me today is, well, we don't want girls eating a low-calorie diet, certainly, but maybe if they're eating a, a normal diet or a high-calorie diet, they have to be exercising, so they're burning some of those calories and using them in the, in the proper way for their age group. They don't know all of this for sure yet. They're still looking into it, and kind of the, the next phase of this research will look at brain development and what might be happening in the brain uh, after puberty sets off sooner. All right, David, thank you very much.